I hate the way math is taught these days. I don't understand any of it. Comments like this are all over social media. In fact, I hear them from many parents and many teachers, too. Here's the thing, though. Did you like math growing up? Did you feel like you understood math? How do you feel about it now? If the answer to any of those questions was, no, I didn't really like math, no, I didn't really understand math, no, I still don't really like math, then that is actually why we're teaching math in a different way than we used to. Math wasn't accessible to so many students in the past. Yes, there were some students that loved the way math was taught, but honestly, for most students, it wasn't the best way. That's why we're teaching math in slightly different ways now. That's why we use different strategies and techniques than we may have used in the past. Because for so many of us in the past, the way we taught it didn't make sense. The way we taught it wasn't valuable. It didn't give enough students the fair access to the concepts we were trying to teach them. However, what we're trying to do now is to change the narrative, to make the classrooms more student-centered, more student-focused, to think about what can the students do? How do we build off of that? How do we actively help students to make connections to different strategies they might not have made on their own? And what we're seeing in the classrooms is a world of difference. Students are way more engaged in the math classroom. Students are learning more. They're making deeper connections. They're remembering things with less instruction. So instead of complaining about how math is taught differently these days, I challenge you to embrace the change because what we were doing wasn't working and this works a whole lot more. Yes, it can be a little bit scary to have change, but we're doing this for more students to be able to access the mathematics around them.